the central plains oasis. I fought all the way to defeat countless masters. Everywhere I went, there was always utter misery. People called me Iron Merciless. However, I was not really heartless. I just pulled a knife to help me when I saw injustice. And the real purpose of my trip is to come to China to find the unique treasure handed down from ancient times. Medicine. I have been studying in China for three years. As an African student in Nanchang University, I have been able to speak Chinese and read Chinese textbooks since I didn't speak a word of Chinese when I first came to China. In the continuous progress, I'm deeply in love with China. In the year 1999, I met a Chinese doctor working in Africa. After reading many medical books from him, I began to yearn for China. My mother's diabetes is also under the treatment of the Chinese medical team. The condition has been controlled, good health. So I decided to study medicine in China after graduating from university. My parents sent me over to China to come study medicine. And after I've graduated, I'm gonna go back to my country to help with the med medical department. It's true that uh, reciting uh, complex medical terminologies is a headache, but it's also important if you want to learn medicine, you have to memorize it. After three years of study, I have been able to go back for oh, what rounds. Every Friday in the second affiliated hospital of Nanchang University, students can observe patients under the guidance of their teachers. I can basically diagnose patients on my own, but I'm not a good doctor yet. So my reaction times are too slow. So I need to think of the diagnosis. I like to eat Chinese food, learned the art of Chinese shadow boxing, and more importantly, I came across a lot of Chinese friends and formed a deep friendship. I often say with pride, China is my home now. I like Asian Chinese poetry, especially Li Bai's poems of Tang Dynasty which is called Shi Xian. I like Li Bai's poems because I can feel his love and his poems are of the same of those of Shakespeare, from which we can read the same living conditions or translation of high spirits. After I came to China, I began to learn shadow boxing. Shadow boxing can calm people's mind. Since the 1960s, Nearly a thousand African students like me have come to China to study medicine. We have overcome the language and cultural barriers. We have studied the same courses, taken the same exams, and studied all the essentials carefully. We hope that we can help our people when we return to Africa. <laughs>